Hi friends, it's Teacher Carrie Ray. It's time for writing class, so come on over. When we do writing, we need to get our supplies. We'll need some paper, a highlighter, and a pencil. You and your grown-up. At preschool, sometimes you might already know how to write your name, or maybe you're still learning, so we like to help you with that. You can ask your grown-up for a little help with your highlighter and say, could you write my name, please, so that I can trace it? I'll do my name so you can see what I mean. K-A-R-I-R-A-E. That's me. I'm Teacher Carrie Ray. This is what it will look like when you wrote it with your highlighter. Some friends' names are long and take up the whole row, maybe even two. Some friends' names are short and just take up a little bit. When your name is in the highlighter, then you can work on writing it or tracing. When you hold a pencil, it's important to hold with three fingers. We call this a tripod grip. That just makes sure that we're holding our pencil in a way that will really work well for us while we're writing. Let's trace. K-A-R-I with the dot, R-A-E. Oh no, friends, I was pushing a little too hard with my pencil and a tiny rip happened. It's okay though. I traced my name. There's a little rip there. I wonder what I could use to fix it. Hmm. It's on my paper and it's a small rip. I wonder how I could solve this problem. Do you have an idea? Use your thinking cap. How could I fix a tiny rip? Maybe some tape? I'll use my I spy eye and see if we have some tape in the classroom. We do. It's on the art shelf. When you're done using your pencil to trace, then you can think, do I need to practice more words? Could I trace my name again with a different color? There's lots of options that you can do when you're in writing class. Now that we traced our name together, I wanted to show you what it might look like when you're at school. This is our writing center and we always have paper, things to write with, and different things to use to draw. This is like a magic eraser where we have something to draw and magically erases. We also have some different things to write on that aren't paper, like chalkboards. And sometimes we have dry erase over here also. We have shapes that you can trace and things that help you draw fun shapes also, like squiggles, flowers. All of these things are in our writing center at school, ready for you to use. Thanks for tracing your name with me, friends. See you next time.